Hello all, Shoestring here. Today I want to talk about my 1.5 watt solar panel that I got from Harbor Freight. It cost me right around $15, but you can get different prices depending on the coupons. This is from Harbor Freight, so of course it's a Thunderbolt, and it will have the standard Harbor Freight plug-in. You see right there. Uh, most Harbor Freight Thunderbolt equipment comes with plug-ins like this. You can also you can get it with a car battery uh, cigarette lighter plug-in, or you can get it with the clamps like we have right here. They of course all plug in together, match really well. Okay, so this is actually just for trickle charging. If you have a major battery that you've drained and you want to charge it back up, this is not the solar panel to use. This is simply for trickle charging. I had a 2007 Colorado that I really loved, but the battery would drain a lot. I used one of these and it kept it up all the time. So if you have a battery that drains slowly, that for some reason is not on your um, regular battery bank that you can charge. You hook one of these up to it, and it works nicely. But remember, it's only a 1.5, and it's not going to totally charge up a battery once you drain it. This is specifically for trickle charging, keeping batteries charged up that you don't use a lot, or that has a very slow charge to it. But it's small, so it's easy to take this, set it outside in the sun, hook it up to your battery, and it stays out of the way. I normally use these clamps because I have several small batteries that don't always keep a charge, or I'd several that I just want to keep ready. So I have three or four of these. They're nice little devices. I've had several questions about them because I've used these in some of my other videos. Folks wanted to see what they look like. And this is what they look like. I do recommend them. They work well. Remember, I don't get any money from Harbor Freight. Nobody is paying me to recommend any of this. I just do it. Now, here's a note. We normally say never, ever hook up a solar panel directly to a battery without a charge controller. This case, you may be able to get away with it. If you read the directions, it says you should have some type of charge controller for it. So, you would take your solar panel, connect it to where it says solar panel, right? Take your clips, connect it to where it says battery, right there. And then hook those to your battery. Important thing to remember with this Thunderbolt, it is only a 1.5. I can't stress that enough. Don't buy this if you need to just charge a battery up after every use. This is for slow trickle charging. If you have any questions, put them down in the comments. Be more than happy to answer any of them. If you know anyone that may need this information, of course, feel free to share. If you like this type of video, please subscribe and like it and shoestring 